Priceless Rock led by almost two lengths to McFryers and Dane Finn who's being bustled along on the inside of Costa to Costa. A length and a half handyman about to be extricated away from the fence. Then on the rail, Ken's Business, Killat Black Grape. Further back behind them, Power Pack at the head of the other, zero to 60. And down towards the inside, Jungfrau Girl in the straight. Priceless Rock booted away from McFryers. Black Grape runs on Dane Finn. And down the outside, Profound Effect with a run, handyman coming through in the middle. Handyman, Black Grape, and now Profound Effect. It's Profound Effect sweeping past Black Grape. Profound Effect wins the last. Profound Effect drew clear to be Black Grape, handyman, kill at zero. To Fred, a very honest horse uh, is Profound Effect. It takes a while to get the victories. Uh, now 47 starts for the third, but doesn't do a lot right, as it always runs on strongly. Look, he's more honest than good. Um, and he doesn't win out of turn, but um, I thought it ran a very good race today and Randy gave him every chance, settled him early, probably got clear at the right time and got home good. What we saw in this campaign so far, the form lines are around Stocks and Star Lightning in those races, was able to get back and run on strongly. So were you confident with the way that the day had been playing out that you were a chance in this final race? No, I couldn't be confident. I was just hopeful and, uh, like I said, very pleased with the run, actually. It was good for Randy, good for me. Certainly was a very good by ride, uh, by ride by Randy. He seems to be improving all the time, doesn't he, the way that he's just able to settle these gallopers? I think he's got a future, you know. He's a natural lightweight and he's very keen. He's got good, good balance as a rider and I think there is a future for him. He's a little bit more experienced. He'll be one of the better riders here. Now, we know in this game we always look ahead, so we'll already move past that victory and we'll take a look at Saturday with Light in my veins. Uh, how are you feeling about that? Well... <laughs> Looking forward to it in a way, but I mean, it's he's no gimme. I mean, he, the, if even that was a group race that he won, it wasn't an extra strong field. Uh, he's got to get back and do it again. And, um, you know, as I say, he's uh, potentially a very nice horse, but he's got to prove himself in better company. Do you feel pressure anymore in this game? Yep. <laughs> Best of luck on the weekend. <laughs> Thanks, Adam. We'll just grab Randy Tan now as well. And Randy, a really nice performance there. Profound effect. Uh, looked to let down nicely. Yeah, um... I thought he would be on a pace, but then he jumped a little bit slow, so I had to sit him back and travel real good up to the straight, and I hook him out and he just kept going. Able to start out of tr uh, trouble as well, which seemed to be the big difference. Yeah, definitely. How impressed were you with the turn of foot? Very. Well done, mate. Good ride. Thanks.